So on today's episode of what kind of redneck shit is group up to? Let me show you how I got back from Tennessee. How a three hour trip turned into an 11 hour trip. And let's see what we can do to remedy the issue other than how I did it on the road. Uh, let me get my camera slipped, or, slipped around and I will show you. So this contraption here, uh, zip ties, USB cable, and Gorilla Tape got me home. Let me show you what happens when that is removed. As you see, I left the USB cable wrapped around it. And yes, it is literally wrapped around a fucking wire. That wire goes into the body control module. Here's what happens when it's not working properly. and nothing. If I move the wire to a certain spot, of driving down the road moves it and everything shuts off so after fighting with that for 11 hours in Tennessee trying to get home this past Sunday once I finally figured out what the problem was this was the solution I don't like that. I gotta figure out what's causing it and fix it properly. New development. There's the plug wire that plugs into the VCM or body control module. As you can tell, that end is, um, yeah. Crusty like Freddy Krueger's face. Okay guys, I've tested it a few times here in the driveway. Uh, seems to be working fine. Um, I'm gonna take it up the road here in just a few minutes and just see what it does. In the meantime, if I could get my camera to switch. You'll get the idea. Fire's right up. Well, test ride was successful. Test ride was successful. Uh, I made sure I hit as many of the bumps in my road from the washboarding as I could. Nothing jiggled loose, no issues with the wire. I think we're good. 
Uh, only time will tell, I guess. But I'm happy for the most part. It ain't ideal, but it works. So we're going to ride it. Y'all have a good one. Thanks for watching.